Hello everybody, welcome back to another Rails tutorial. In this video, we're going to be going over the active record where query method. The where method is an easy way to query for methods in Ruby on Rails and find active record models that you could not find an easier way. So without further ado, let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to post my project on GitHub. It's going to be in the description below, but I'm going to go into my Rails console where I've already created 100 zombie models. I did this in my Faker tutorial, which I also post on YouTube, and there will be a link in the description below. So as you can see, I have 100 zombies, and there are a few ways that I can sort through these zombies. One thing I could do is, since all my zombies have a name and an age, I could get all my zombies where my age is greater than 50. Boom. And and then simply, I could, I see that I have Claude Shannon, his age is 95. Then I have Alda Hodovix, his, his age is 86. And it goes all the way down from there. Okay? So, that's pretty easy. The ages could be out of order. They're not necessarily in order. But that's the ages right there. And then another quick thing you can do is you could also query the ages where you could also reverse it and do where age is not the query. So I'm going to say where not age is greater than 50. So I'm going to get less, I'm going to get everything less than 50. So now I get ages of 34, 20, and so on. Another thing you can do with the where, the where method is you can also put long statements in it. You can put um, advanced query statements. So here within the string, I have age is greater than 50. So a basic programming line. Age is a field in the model and 50 is just an integer that's interpreted as in the string. Another thing you can do with the where query method is that you can make the statements more advanced. And you can do this by adding and or or clauses to your model queries. One thing I could do is I could search for the age being over 40 or the age is less than 20. Just for the sake of this example, I'll search for senior citizens, people 45 or people who have age of under 18. So, you know, people who usually may get special privileges at amusement parks. So if I do zombie dot, I'm, I get zombies over 65 or zombies under 18, all in my active record relation array, which I can then iterate over. That's pretty cool. The thing you can do is search for straight up equality. For instance, where age equals 65. And we at least get, we get one zombie with an age of 65. Hardy Leffler. <laughs> Thing the where clause can do is it can search for multiple parameters by using a hash. So this time we're going to look for zombies where the age could be a multitude of things. It could be maybe 2, 23, or 65. So I can do this by passing in a hash with the curly braces and then giving in my parameters, age, and then my keys can be arrays of the parameters I want to search for. So I can give it multiple things in my array to say, I want to search for two, 23 and 65. And then in this case, 34. And then when I click enter, why did not, oh, I forgot. Forgot to close my array. So now, as you can see, my terminal says, select zombies from zombies where zombies age in two, 34, 65. So it did search for zombies that are 34, 65, and it found a zombie that was 34 and 65, and none that were two, unfortunately. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you guys have a great day. Let me know what I can do better, and let me know if you enjoyed this video. Have the best day of your lives. Also, I'm gonna include the documentation link to this, to the where method in this video, so you can look at all their examples. See you later.